Hi, French Horn friends. Uh, great to see you today. I uh, just wanted to go through some um, of your lesson with you uh, that we've done in class. Um, I want to start with some long tones and some triads we'll do together and then we'll also play our scale or C major scale today. So let's start by playing a C, making sure we start every note with our tongue right behind our lips and then also that small aperture in our mouth breathing upward for the higher notes when we play those higher notes um, in our C scale. So let's start with a long tone on C. Um, here we go. And now our C triad where we play C, E, G, high C, G, E, and C. And we don't press any valves for those notes. Let's do that triad without tonguing all the notes. We'll slur them. Great job. Um, make sure that you continue with long tones and your rhythm studies in your book as well. Those are super important. We'll be doing more videos in the future about those. But let's play that C scale. So we have our C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C, B, A, G, F, E, D, and C. And of course, this is located, sorry, on page 42 of your lesson book in the middle of the page, the C major scale. So you definitely want to take a look at that while we play that. Here we go. scale one more time and um, I'll use more air too. Nice big strong tonguing. <laughs> together is early bird march and we are going to first uh, finger and say our first four measures remembering that um, we have a whole note in measure four and we know that that's got to get four beats so let me give us our starting pitch in measure one which is that high C <laughs> there's our high C let's finger and say that together Ready, go. C, A, C, B flat, A, G, G, A, G, F, E. And now we're going to play through the whole song. Here we go. One, two, ready, here we go. <laughs> Twenty-one, two. 
two, three, four. running through it. Um, what I think we're going to do now is I'm going to divide up your time into segments. So um, I'm going to go on to clarinet blues and um, then we're going to take a quick break and I'll have a separate link for the remainder of your two songs, which of course is Star Wars and Bugler's Rule. So take a minute right now to empty out your French horn. Awesome. <laughs> and um, I just realized I had music playing in the background. So I'm sorry. I hope that that didn't um, distract you at all. Okay. So for clarinet blues, um, as I look at that, I see that there's B flat in the key signature. And we know that B flat, just like we just played in Early Bird March, is first valve where B natural is second. So I wanna make sure that we take note of that. There's also a repeat in the middle of the song. Um, I'm sure you remember we talked about that quite a bit. So we're going to play from the beginning all the way down to 17, and then we repeat back to measure five, and then we play to the end. Um, we do have some measures of rest. I see in bar 21, there's that big thick black line with a three. And of course that tells us that there are three measures of rest. So we'll make sure we count that as well. And um, let's first finger and say the first couple of measures to make sure we get it back into our minds. Here is our first note. So we have our E ready, we'll say it and finger it ready and go E, 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 F, G, A, rest, A, B flat, B flat, A. Of course, we just landed at measure five. So let's play this through together on our E. One, two, ready, here we go. Measure 12. 
Measure five, measure six, two, three, four, three, four, measure eight, two, three, four, measure ten, two, three, eleven, three, four, measure twelve. I'm sure you remember over that last note that A, there's a fermata, which means we held that a little bit longer. And also that accent over 45 is called a marcato, which means short, but attacked very hard with the tongue. So awesome job with that, guys. Um, stay tuned. We will do Bugler's Rule and Star Wars next. Thank you, guys. Have a great day. <laughs>